All right, let's, ex uh, let's explore an exponential function now with a base that's different than e. Sorry about that. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to look at a hornet's nest. And we're going to look at a population of 10 on May 1st. The, hornet, the number of hornets grows to 50 in 30 days. And it says that the, they're growing at a rate proportional to population. So when I look at that, what I'm seeing is I start with 10, I stop at 50, and this reduces to 5. This is my proportion that I have to have. This is my value of B. I've got some lag here, sorry. All right, now that's B. Uh, I have an initial population of 10, that's Y zero, okay? On May 1st, the number of hornets grows to 50 in 30 days. Okay, we got that. If the growth continues to follow the same model, how many days after May 1st will the population reach 100? Well, we wanna know T, we don't know, all right? T, we don't know. We know that we end up with a population of 100. And here's the, here's the H part. Did you see H in there? It takes 30 days to go from 10 to 50, okay? And remember, this is proportional. So at the end of that 30 days, we've succeeded in growing one time, all right? So that means that H is gonna be one over 30, all right? So here's what my problem is gonna look like. 100 equals 10 times 5 to the 1, what the heck, 10 times 5 to the 1 30th times uh, t, all right? t is what we're interested in. So divide both sides by 10. And when you divide both sides by 10, you get 10 equals five to the t over 30th, t over 30 power. And the only way to handle this is to natural log both sides. And remember when we do this, what happens is I get the natural log of 10 is equal to the natural log of five to the t over 30 power. Well, any exponent inside a logarithm can be written outside the logarithm using multiplication. So natural log of 10 equals t over 30 times the natural log of 5. Hey, this is, we're making some progress here. Divide both sides by the natural log of 5. So the natural log of 10 divided by the natural log of 5 is equal to t over 30. And then you'll notice that I can finish this off by multiplying both sides by 30. So 30 times the natural log of 10 over the natural log of five will give me T. And uh, when we do that, you're gonna end up with 42.92 days. So there you go, a little exponential growth with a base other than E.